Hoo doggy, we really got it going on this morning. Hi everybody, it's Louie with BestSilverGoldDeals.com and let's get rolling on the deals. First, we will start with spot prices. Oh yeah, you're going to like this if you've been buying. We've got gold um, at $25.26, up $21.70, and silver up $0.42 cents to $29.76. It's going to punch at 30, punch right through it and go to 32. That's what I think. Okay, the GSR is uh, plummeting here as silver uh, tries to catch up with gold. Gold uh, hitting all-time highs in the futures market and spot uh, following. So uh, GSR around 85 with the downside pretty easily down to 77. And if we get really lucky, down to 73. You do the math, uh, what about a 15% drop in the GSR could easily put us over 32. Or well, let's see, 29, 30 times 15 would be about 3150. Yeah, I think we're setting up for a run to 32. Okay, the 10 year is constructive here, down a little bit, uh, 3.865 as it continues to drop. However, uh, we had the Democratic National Convention come out and uh, they are throwing money around. So uh, I don't know, at some point the 10 year yield may revolt and say enough spending. Uh, we'll have to see about that. And the dollar, yeah, plummeting further, uh, 101.79, very good for silver and gold. Um, so a dollar looks like it wants to go lower. Copper prices, okay, as you know, copper caught a bid. Uh, it busted, uh, had a false breakdown below 4, and now we are sitting at uh, about 419. Today it is up uh, about a half a penny, uh, not much, but uh, copper coming off the bottom here which is good. Okay, in the economic calendar, uh, today is Tuesday. We've got Atlanta Fed President uh, Bostic uh, speaking, and then uh, Michael Barr, Vice Chair speech. Tomorrow we have minutes from the July FOMC. We'll see if they fine-tune uh, that release. May not be anything. And then on Thursday, initial jobless claims, which will uh, definitely move the markets. And then Powell speaks at uh, Jackson Hole on Friday. Okay, so uh, metals love to rally into economic releases. All right, man, a lot going on, and I'm really happy to see these prices catch up here. A little fire igniting under gold and silver. And let's get going to the best deals we can find. All the links are changing, and uh, we've got to find some of the deals that have not adjusted yet if you have not been buying. All right, one tenth gold eagle at Liberty, two eighty eight. One tenth maple, two seventy eight at bullion exchanges. One tenth Britannia, two sixty three at Liberty. One tenth Philharmonic, two seventy at Liberty. One quarter ounce Britannia, six sixty seven at Liberty. Random gold deal. 644 at bullion exchanges. We're in the quarter ounce category. Quarter ounce Eagle, 654, good price, BGASC. Half ounce Eagle, 1342 at Liberty. Half ounce Maple, 1312 at Liberty, good price. Is that in stock? Yeah. One ounce Eagle, Twenty-five ninety-four at bullion exchanges, and the buffalo was up this morning at Costco, um, and also a great deal on silver eagles on eBay. I sent that alert out to subscribers of the website bestsilvergolddeals.com. It's totally free. Get over there and subscribe. Best buffalo is at uh, bullion exchanges 2595 so i think it was the buffalo that was up this morning at 2599 then you get your four percent off and hit a home run with a buffalo best maple 2552 at bullion exchanges best one ounce gold britannia 2557 at bullion exchanges best krugerand 2547 at bullion exchanges 
Okay, skipping the Libertads this morning. The Hunter Corona is right around spot. Here's a discount code if you want it. I'm going to go right to uh, Gold Bar in Assay, SD Bullion, throwing up a great deal on the Una Bar, uh, $25.86 for the one ounce Una and the Lion Bar. Gold Bar in Assay. All right, Platinum Eagle, $10.83 at Bold. Random Platinum Coin, 1062 at SD Bullion. Platinum Bar, 1031 at Bullion Exchanges, good price. Palladium Bar, 1041 at Bullion Exchanges. And uh, uh, Platinum still ahead of Palladium. <clears throat> platinum, uh, whatever, in the 950s or 970s. Uh, definitely going to march to 1,000 here, in my opinion. Not financial advice. But uh, Platinum loves to circle all around 1,000. So I think we have a little more upside in Platinum and definitely Silver. One Silver Eagle at spot at Bullion Exchanges. Remainder of the two, cheapest at Bold, 34.38. Those Eagles on eBay this morning were 32.50 before discounts. Uh, cheapest quantity of 20 over at Pinehurst. So don't let the first price scare you. Go to the 20 category. 33.72 for BU Eagles at Pinehurst. Okay, and what I'm saying here in the time to buy is uh, blah, 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 blah. Silver and gold in breakout mode now, above the moving averages and seemingly headed higher as gold continues to achieve higher highs and silver tries to retest 32. Silver in catch-up mode and GSR likely to head much lower. People right now are saying, geez, I missed that move in gold. I didn't buy enough or I didn't buy any. But look at silver. Silver is still pretty cheap at 29 bucks. It's not even 30 yet. That's why silver is catching up here, guys. Okay, and that's what it always does. And I have to say, Given the political environment, um, we've got some scary stuff being promised on the campaign trail. And I'm not going to get into details on which party or who, but looks like we're going full-on banana republic, higher taxes, um, price controls. If those policies uh, get instituted, um, you're, you're going to watch a great deal of fear set into... Uh, people that are concerned about the uh, the value of their money, and I've seen this before, and I think it is uh, they're lighting the fuse on precious metals here when they're du doubling down on tax and spend. That's all I'm saying. Okay, maples one at spot at bullion exchanges. Remainder of the tube, bullion exchanges thirty two eighty three. We've got kangaroos thirty two fifty three. Uh, bullion exchanges. We've got Britannia's 32.21 at bullion exchanges. See how cheap these prices still are? These premiums have not adjusted yet. You watch what happens when the investor comes back into gold and silver. Philharmonic, still a good price. They're not 29 anymore. Hope you were buying them then. 31.48 at Golden Eagle, and they have free shipping over a certain value. Okay, and I think it was the Buffalo that was up. Is it still up? At Costco and the Buffalo, $25.99. Then 4% off, 2% with a decent credit card, like the Wells Fargo cashback card. Um, and 2% on the Executive Club membership will get you 4% off. We'll get you that Buffalo for under spot this morning, um, if you don't mind paying higher prices for gold. Yeah, they're higher and going higher still, looks like. Um, so, uh, yeah, Gold Buffy up at Costco still. Okay, and uh, nothing else was up there. All right, now we have got uh, Constitutional 22.33 times face at Bullion Express. We've got these walkers are still up at Monument Metals, 22.67 times face. And I think the Benjis are out of stock there, but check out Monument if you want to pick up something like the Mercs. Uh, they're a little pricier this morning at about 24 times face. Uh, at Monument Metals, but uh, who doesn't love Merck Dimes? My number one pick for Constitutional, if you can get it cheap. Okay, let's do a random 10-ounce bar. Monument Metals, 317. 
Let's do another bar, 310 at Golden Eagle. Man, their font is small. Uh, we have got Hero Bullion, 319 for a brand new Unity bar. By the way, that jerky turned out really good. I gave my neighbor a big batch of it. And you know, my neighbor has a, a giant victory garden. He's an old timer and he has got more veggies than he can use. I got a little teeny plot, but uh, we're, we're doing some good trading. Yeah, beef jerky is a, a fungible uh, barter item. Uh, best buffalo over at uh, Kazoo, 31.37. There's a $5 off code on the Kazoo website. Random one ounce, uh, 31.20 at SD Bullion. G um, uh, Golden State Mint has a new deal up. It is 31.24. For these very cool uh, right to bear arm silver round. Those are nice. You can hand those out at Christmas as well. Very nice. Uh, five ounce Bullion Max has a starter deal, 151 for a five ounce bar. One ounce generic bars are 3230 over at Monument Metals. A little pricey on that. How about these bars here? Uh, 3230 at Monument Metals. Did I do that twice? Okay, the chiclets, the only cheap Germania, uh, I think, uh, is still the box of chiclets. You get 20 of these. They are fantastic. 640 puts you at 32 an ounce on the Germania chiclet. Definitely get those guys. You'll have to pay up for the RCM Kilo, but if you want a beat up Kilo, $9.91 is what you'll pay over at Provident. And we will be beating these deals on eBay. Not all the eBay sellers have adjusted their prices yet. The libs are cheap. They're going to be about $34 a coin out the door after rebates. Uh, in the Silver Eagle category, uh, yeah, no more $6.49 Silver Eagles. Um, he even had some uh, 21 Type 1s in the mix there. Oh, man, would that be sweet? Uh, if you want to skip the culls, so the culls are uh, $33.50, um, about $32.50 after 3% rebates. Uh, use that PayPal card or the American Express credit card. Links on my website. And if you want to get up to a BU tube, looks like those are about $34, about $33 after rebates. Uh, for Silver Eagles. Okay, in the maple category, cheapest maple is, is it a real deal? Uh, only one left. Yeah, stuff is selling out this morning. All the links were changing rapidly. Uh, we got 25 silver maples. They are random maples, so they may not be shield guard. Uh, 823 looks like a pretty good price. Let's see about that. 823 divided by 25 equals uh, 32.92 times 0.997 is uh, 31.93 out the door for Maple with a good credit card. Okay, so that's 8.23. Let's see if we can beat that with the kangaroos. Uh, kangaroos are going to be 8.13. Okay, better on the kangaroos. Krugerans are going to be 8.23, a little worse on the... Krugerans. Okay, let's uh, skip that. So uh, compare those prices to the major dealers above and see what's cheaper. All right, in the constitutional category. Yeah, this looks good here. Uh, again, if you haven't been buying and you figured, well, now's the time before we run. Um, well, that's a little over these like buried in sand. I don't like the looks of those. Uh, let's see. Let's let this guy. Oh, what are these? Uh, they better be not, oh, 90 percent halves. Whoa, any combined shipping? Uh, so uh, 22.6, and then take uh, 60, 70 cents off. Yeah, you'd be about 21.90 on these Kennedy halves here out the door. Hey, that's a pretty good deal. Again, if you're buying. Okay, so constitutional, pretty good deal there. How cheap is a big lot? Uh, let's get away from the culls. And the slicks, uh, 23, so that'd be about 2210 times face. It's funny, more expensive for the big bags. Why is that? How about a big bag of Mercs, 2372? And that'd be about $75 off, about 23 times face for a big bag of Mercs here. Again, you can just buy that and put it away, guys. Okay, I'm going to skip the Carson Cities and the uh, Peace Dollars this morning, but check them out, man. You want to buy some of those beautiful um, 
a beautiful piece dollar, 60 bucks in the slab. Doesn't PCGS charge about 60 bucks to slab a coin these days? Okay, in the kilo category, 995, about 30 bucks off 965 for a kilo. Anything really attractive here? Uh, let's see. Random kilo, 1037, why so much? Uh, okay, so, oh, there was a stacker, a kilo stacker down there. Oh, where's that kilo stacker? Ooh, 1049. Oh, you got to pay up for that, but you get 30 bucks off. You'd be about 1020 for that Scottsdale kilo stacker. Mmm, sweet bars. Okay, cheapest kilo kook is now 1092. Take about 30 bucks off. A roll of kooks. You can't go wrong with a roll of kooks. A roll of kooks. Yeah, man. Uh, let's see. That is about 35.50 a coin. About 34.50 for kooks. Uh, okay, not too bad. And let's see, let's get into the big deals. Okay, we have got a roll of slow internet. Wow, man, that took a while. Oh, this is the big deal. Uh, 3141 now? Oh, man. But still, 100 bucks off will put you at 30.41. When silver's 32, those will be under spots, so you can you can buy those buffaloes all day long. That's not bad. How about a smaller roll? Uh, those are 31.50 a coin, about 30.50. You can get the smaller stackable Morgans here. Pretty sweet, pretty sweet deal. Is that in stock? I'm telling you, these are these are going to go. These are going to go when silver um, gets over 30. I'm not promising it will, but. When silver gets over 30, and there's nothing about 30 that's going to stop it there. It's going gonna, it's gonna to retest 32. Okay, let's go to the Dragon Bars. Dragon Bars are 35 a bar, about 34 after rebates. Johnson Matthew Bars go as cheap as 325. Uh, 100 ounce bars, I haven't checked those in a long time. Uh, 31.11, and that's going to be about, well, shoot, a little over 30 an ounce. For a random 100 ounce bar. Anything cool in here? Yeah, look at that. Oh, is that the bar you get? Is there only one? Well, that one's been drug around a little bit, but that is a righteous single hard bar. I like that design. That's not the most common design, so 3150, about 3050 for that 100 ounce angle hard. Okay, I can't complain about that. All right, BU Peace Dollars in the tube, 36 a coin, about 35 a coin after rebates. You know I like the BUs. If you're looking for a BU tube of Morgans, those are about 38, no, 37 a coin, about 36 after rebates. Nice. Okay, cheapest platinum coin is going to be 1052, take 30 bucks off. Platinum Eagle is going to be 11.49. Take about 30, 40 bucks off. Let's get to the gold because gold is what is exciting people, and its little sister silver is running behind, grabbing its skirt tail, and flying here just like those. I won't say it. Okay. Um, let's see. We've got a Britannia 270, and then take about eight bucks off. You'd be 262 on a one tenth Britannia. And uh, if you want to get up to a one-tenth eagle, oops, wait a minute, wait a minute. I missed it. Uh, let's see, go back, one-tenth. Let's see what a one-tenth eagle is going for. And one-tenth eagle is going for 290 minus about nine bucks, about 280 on a one-tenth eagle. How about one quarter ounce random? Cheapest one quarter ounce random gold is uh 670 on a britannia and is it for real uh he's only got eight feedback we'd have to go up a notch to a philharmonic and there we go philharmonic 670 take uh, 20 bucks off you'd be at about 650 on a gold philharmonic there if you have those good credit cards okay gold is cheap how about a gold eagle quarter ounce gold eagle this morning 690 and uh, 21 bucks off uh, about 670 on a quarter ounce gold eagle through ebay how about a half ounce well, how about a one ounce gold this is where you're going to save some money if you're buying just buying any old gold. Uh, twenty-five fifty. Uh, okay, twenty-five fifty. No shipping. What's this local pickup stuff? God, you guys drive me crazy with that. 
Uh, oh man, you got to go twenty five ninety nine for a crew grand. But remember, you're going to get eighty bucks off. You're going to be at about twenty five twenty. You're going to be at spot on that crew grand. So uh, keep that in mind when you're buying one ounce gold. You're going to get it pretty much at spot on. Uh, on uh, eBay if you have those credit cards and finally one ounce gold eagle 2640 minus 80 bucks a buffalo is 2650 minus about 80 bucks a five dollar commemorative a little less than a quarter ounce of gold is about 600 bucks that's actually a very good buy right there okay if you're looking for alternatives to the gold eagles and you want a u.s sovereign gold coin the 20 franc is going to be hey that's a good price 480 480 on a Napoleon, uh, and then you would get uh, 15 bucks off. You'd be at 465. I might want to stop and do the math on that. Uh, please see the photo for conditions. Okay, 20 franc is a 20 franc, and let's just do the math on that because that is 2419 uh, metal content. Well, I'm going to go. I'm going to go by memory here. That's always scary, isn't it? Two, four, one, nine. I'm sorry, what am I doing? Uh, 480, 480 divided by 0. 0.2419. Hey, did you guys pick up any of those slabbed Morgans yesterday at Vermilion? Let me know if you did. I'd love to see what you got. Uh, that's going to be. Oh, that's too cheap. 20 franc gold. That's too cheap. Okay, I uh, my memory is not working. Maybe this is less than a point two. Uh, that's embarrassing. Okay, I think it's. I think I used my memory and I shouldn't have. Okay, never mind. Well, anyway, it's still cheap. Okay, and uh, let's find out what is going on. Scottsdale's going to have some auctions. How about the five ounce Rolo? What's that going for? Uh, 173 on eBay. That's about 25 an ounce, about 24 an ounce for the Scottsdale Rolo. Um, I will skip the vintage bars this morning. Here's stuff in my store. I'm loading some new stuff in my store. If you're interested in bottle caps or wedgetail eagles or lunars, got some new stuff there as well as the skulls I like so much. So uh, check it out and definitely ask me for a friend discount. I am selling some stuff that uh, didn't remember I had. Okay, you're going to need a precious metals verifier, an empty monster box, or a vacuum sealer. And you're going to want boots and guns and water filtration technology. The Amex card is 3% off. Also works at the grocery store. Also works um, on Amazon. There's no reason not to have this if you have the good credit. If your credit's not as good, get the PayPal card. They will give you a $500 um, credit limit right off the bat. And then 5 or 10 days later, you'll get your full credit limit. And they, uh, shoot, they do $20,000 credit limits for you guys that... Uh, have better credit so uh, check that out works on eBay all the time and also works other places like the US Mint works on kazoo bullion where you save an extra 1% uh, get that PayPal card okay let's get on to the picks of the day um, and uh, uh, yeah okay 30 gram panda is still pretty cheap at 3373 uh, we've got the gold libs, and uh, what I wanted to draw your attention to is um, these fractionals. Okay, now let's check out. Oh, are they selling? What what happened to the proofs? Okay, the fractionals here. So um, this is what I'm saying about these not being. Oh, the 120 it sold out. No, there they are. Um, 676 oh that's a 2021 what the hell here we go well and look at look at what the oh hold on so the 21 one twentieth gold libertad proof is selling for 676 that's an inflated price and the 2024 120th proof is selling for 169. Now you do the math on that, which means basically multiply by two, and you're at $3,400 melt. 
Okay, $3,400 melt on a collectible 120th proof gold Libertad. Now let's get over to Scottsdale. I want to show you something. This is an advanced tip for you guys. Shop gold. Okay, now I have bought these before. I got these for like, I don't know, like 17 bucks or something in the past. The 120th ounce gold bar, <clears throat> 3730 melt. Okay, and I'm not saying to pay that, but this is what people are paying up for fractional, fractional generic, highly divisible gold. You see the trend here? Now you can get that proof gold lib, the 120th gold lib, at the same melt price and it's collectible. So uh, yeah, you know, at the coin shop, well, they'll offer you a spot. But that's all I'm talking about here is just looking at uh, the collectability, the divisibility, and fractional gold is, it's just gonna keep going up, guys, and it's going to well exceed the melt price of, uh, of gold. You know what I mean? Fractional, because people can't afford the big gold. Look how long the buffaloes stay on Costco. They don't have the money. They only have the money for the fractional. I lost my place. Let me get back to the best silver gold deals. And uh, the other one I wanted to show you, holy moly, where am I? Uh, deals of the day, picks of the day. Okay, um, this modern proof junk deal is still a great deal at 22 times face. But just remember, um, the coin shop may not give you what you think when you go in to cash those in. All right, I got my warrior bars, dudes, and glad I bought them when they were a little cheaper actually a lot cheaper. Uh, I got a set of these and a set of the coppers and I'm going to unbox that for you if I can squeeze some time out this morning. I gotta go to work today. But uh, there's a video coming to show you what these uh, warrior bars go to. They're only making 500 of each. And uh, that that's a total, um, that's just a total wild card, you know. But uh, yeah, so I picked up uh, 30, 60, I picked up 60 ounces of silver and 60 ounces of copper. And this is the reason I have so much damn silver and not enough gold. I keep finding stuff like that. Okay, ATBs are a pretty good price as well. And the Kilo Koala is a pretty good deal. Scottsdale on sale. The Sunshine Mint Round uh, bars is a fantastic deal at 323. And they are in stock at Liberty. I'm going to leave you with that and say happy hunting this morning. If you haven't been buying, I don't think I'd wait any longer, guys. Okay, gold spot 2523, silver spot 2970. They cannot keep it down. Falling dollar, falling 10 year, rising copper prices, profligate spending, scary, scary stuff in Washington, gold all time highs. You tell me you don't want to own, own silver right now? Keep waiting for 25. Yeah. Hoo doggy. I'll see you guys later.